Hello, hello, hello everyone. So lovely to be here at the Rivoli for Reveal Me. This is our lovely kitten, Katie. Yeah! some cool teens about this who informed me that uh, it's very relevant to a certain situation with the Kardashian family members right now, um, which I'm unaware of, but um, I'm glad that it's still as timeless as it was then. But, uh, one of the cool teens was like, why does it always, why does it, why, is it, why do the women always get mad at the other women? They're being pretty easy on the man. It's explain the concept of eternal, internalized misogyny. Uh, and the kids get it. They get that it's bullshit. Um, I hope you guys do too. Uh, and this next song is uh, not, not about internalized misogyny. Uh, but isn't that really? No, but it is a little bit more serious and a little bit more real. It's written by a dear friend of mine. Um, uh, named Meg Remy, and uh, it, uh, she's a singer of a band called U.S. Girls, and this is from a record called In a Poem Unlimited, which was nominated last year for the Polaris Prize. Um, and if you check it out on YouTube, there's a very cool arrangement of this song uh, that I got to compose for the Polaris Prize. Um, and, uh, thank you. Thank you. It was very nice. <laughs> 
I really appreciate it. Um, uh, I'd like to also, I'd really like to thank Red and my dear friend Daytona, sneaking back to the bar back there. Uh, for, everyone can see you with that giant wig. Um, We've been doing really bad Australian accents backstage. Um, but anyway, uh, I'd like to thank my friend Daytona for inviting me tonight. Uh, and I'd like you all to check out the song. Yeah, it's called Home. And uh, I just think it's a really good song. Well, something the world really needs right now. So anyway, thank you for having me. Yeah.